Hey everybody, Susie Q here at Q Aquatics. And today I found some Biaje eggs. So excited. Let's go take a look. So although I just did an update on this tank, this tank got really murky with the um, sump not being clean. So I did a full cleaning. My Biaje Baradis laid eggs. They spawned. I'm so excited. Let's let's look. We're gonna see if we can focus in on this guy. See him right there. Yes, that's the one that had eggs. So I came over here to the angel, with the side where the angels are. There's a pair of angels that I thought were gonna be spawning. And then I looked down and I see this little girl. I'm like, aren't you the most beautiful cichlid ever? Well, she actually, right now, she's looking very, very pale. I'm thinking she hasn't slept in days. Those eggs look beautiful. I'm hoping everything is good. I'm not sure if I need to remove these. So if you guys know about Biaje eggs and a community tank like this, should I remove the eggs now? I mean, now it'd be easy to remove them. I have a cycle tank already for them if I need to. Or should I think that she's just gonna protect them. Well, she's guarding the eggs and he's supposed to be guarding the territory. Let's see what he's doing. Oh, he's not doing anything. He's not guarding anything. Dude, you got babies over there. <laughs> yeah, he's not doing anything. So as you can see, I got clown loaches, I got rainbows, and I got quarry cats in here. Did I say angels? Yeah. And two plecos. So I'm not sure if I should be removing these and put them in their own tank and let them, or should I let them do what they're gonna do and hope that we get a couple survivors? She's really good at keeping those quarry cats away. Like, look how pale she is. I don't think she slept. I mean, I don't, I'm not one to mix with nature, but I could really use some suggestions here because I would really love to raise these fry. Or if I put these in another tank, should I put the parents with them? So if you guys have any suggestions or ideas and you've bred these before, please let me know. Um, I think I have another day or so before they become wigglers. They're gonna be wigglers, okay. So I will accept any suggestions. I do have a tank ready to go. It's only, um, it's a 15 gallon tank. So I don't know if it'll be all right for the parents, but it'll definitely be all right for that rock with the uh, eggs on them. So just leave a comment below if you know, if you've done this before and it was successful, because I really would like the, to raise up these uh, fry. Thanks for checking out my cichlid eggs. I'm very excited. 